Welcome to our lecture online. So in the previous video we saw that if we have a inscribed angle inside a circle that the measure of the inscribed angle ABD is equal to one half the measure of the intercepted arc. And so in a case like this we have perfect symmetry where the center is right in the middle where these two lines right here the distance from each of the two chords to the center is equal, congruent, Yes, that seems to make sense. We can accept that. But what if we have special cases like this? What if it's off-center? What, what if we have one of the chords equal to the diameter of the circle, and here we have another chord, and we again have the angle measure from A to B to D. Is that angle measure still one-half the intercepted arc? And what if we have a case like this, where we have the angle from A to B to D. Is that angle measure equal to half the measure of the intercepted, intercepted arc? And the answer is yes indeed. It doesn't matter what the shape is, which way it's directed, this is always going to be the case. It's always going to be one half the measure of the intercepted arc, which in this case would be AD. And so therefore we don't have to put a question mark there. We can simply say yes, this is always true. Let me clean up a little bit. Always true, no matter what it looks like. All the special cases again adhere to this theorem and that is how it's done.